In today's video, I'm going to be counting down the top five cartoons I think a, any adult can enjoy. And also, these are just kind of just some of my favorite cartoons that I just wanted to share. Uh, these are in no particular order. I'm just counting them down. Number five is Flapjack. I just recently started watching this show. This show's got like a really creepy, gross out type of thing to it that I thought was funny like right away. And it's gross and creepiness I think is something that adults enjoy in cartoons, at least I do. It's like gross in a funny way, not like a gross gross way, if that makes sense. And it also helps that the creator of regular show used to write and storyboard Flapjack. That kind of pushes it over the edge for a good show for me. I bet you can't guess what other shows on this list since I just kind of gave it away. Oh. Number four is Spongebob. I think Spongebob is one of those shows that people either love that show or hate it. I can understand why people wouldn't like this show, but I think most adults can enjoy this show, especially if you just like stupid, like silly humor. Well, everyone knows what SpongeBob is, so let's go on to the next one. Number three is Avatar, The Last Airbender. This is a great show for kids and adults. For one thing, there's awesome, awesome character development in this show. And the storyline is just amazing. There's a lot of uh, twists and turns in the show and a lot of surprises that I, did, I never saw coming. There are a lot of silly, dumb kid jokes in the show, but I can easily overlook it because it's only like a small part of the show and the awesomeness of the show like totally makes up for the stupid kid stuff in it. Number two is Justice League. I think superheroes are good for all ages. I will admit superhero shows can be kind of corny and like campy, but Justice League is not one of those shows. It has a very seriousness to it. You can definitely tell when they uh, were making Justice League and Justice League Unlimited that they definitely had adults in mind for that show because you can just tell that they wanted adults to enjoy the show with their kids when they made this show. And it's a good way to learn about superheroes if you don't, if you're wanting to get into that and you don't know a lot about the DC superheroes. It's a really good show to like jump into and to learn some other heroes that you might not know about. Oh, why I'm talking about superheroes, I have to mention some shows I've been watching on Netflix. Young Justice, I just finished that, and I just finished Green Lantern, the animated series. Both really awesome shows. If you like Justice League, you would probably like those two shows. And number one is Regular Show. I just love Regular Show. That is my favorite show right now. This show is definitely got some serious and really silly humor to it, which I really like a lot. And I just think there's there's a lot of jokes that kids don't get in this show that adults would. And a lot of 80s references that adults get, obviously, and kids today would not get that at all. The one thing I really love about the show is there's character development. In most shows, like Spongebob, for instance, Spongebob, that character, he's never going to change. He's always going to be Spongebob. Squidward's always going to be Squidward, you know. But in regular show, they you can look at the main characters, Mordecai and Rigby, and you can look from season one to season five, and you can actually see how they've changed and how they've grown up a little bit, maybe just a little bit. And you can look at the other characters, Muscle Man, and how much he's grown and actually matured a little bit, I think. Like I said, that's just some of my favorite shows that I think other adults can enjoy. Tell Tell me what your favorite cartoon is in the comments and like this video if you liked it, subscribe if you want to, and I'll see you guys later.